There we have it, the 64 range. Mm -mm, six levels to go. So there we are, there's 70 Slayer. Now I'm going to switch up the attack style to defensive. Uh, we really need to get my, well, I really need to get myself a whip so I can change my defense to 70. Then I can wear barrows, and then hopefully I can be, I'll be able to get uh, 70 range as well. But the next level you'll be seeing will be 55 Slayer. There we go. Broad ammunition, leaf bladed sword, as well as hopefully I can use the Slayer Dart spell as well. That would be nice. I'm just going to double check that. There it is. I have 50 magic as well. 55 Slayer. I do need 55 Slayer for the Slayer staff as well as 50 magic. So I can use it. I just need to get my hands on some mind runes and some death runes as well as one of those staffs. And let's. I kind of want to do Shades of Morton quest real quick. And then we can do a trip of Barrows just for the first time for the heck of it. Man, it's always good to be back in this Barrows area. Although I'm only level 83, all I'm trying to do right now is just at least get one chest loot. I'm going to kill all the Barrows brothers, get 14 kill count, and I'm, get, I'm going to get myself a um, a Guthans War Spear. Just, you just watch. Oh, rip. <laughs> That's why no one likes Carol. There's the murder mystery quest we can complete, and now I'm going to move on to, I think it is the big choppy bird hunting. If I'm going to have a little look now, I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure this is going to be the next quest that I'm going to have to do. I can do it, so I'm going to um, knock that quest out of the way really quickly because I'm doing a recipe for, the, for disaster. I'm trying to get as many gloves as I can because I did die at Barrows and I did lose my combat bracelet and I thought I may as well just do some quests um, so I can then get, I guess, better gloves so I don't have to buy expensive um, combat braces every single time and it'd be nice just to have some Barrows gloves, I guess, you know, and I guess it'd be nice to have some sort of uh, RFD gloves in the process, because I do, I do like the look of RFD gloves, and they're always nice. So I'm going to do the big chumpy bird hunting as soon as I can, and hopefully get the Lumbridge, uh, the Lumbridge guide free from his stuck in the feast. He's got, um, I think he's a little bit fat in the chair, so I'm going to have to free him up somehow, but that's what I'm doing right now. And... and... Big Chumpy Bird Quest, duh. Okay, so hopefully you can hear me. Um, we're currently going to complete, hopefully, if I cook this, what is it? A raw guide cake. If I, okay, good. So I just cooked the kike of, the kike, the cake of guidance. I'm going to use this on the Lumbridge dude. And then we're going to free him and get myself the next set of gloves. And hopefully, I'll be able to get some more gloves after this. 2.5k cooking, 2.5k magic, and only one quest point. Uh, not too bad, I guess. I've only got four council members to go, um, so that's always nice. I'm going to see what gloves I have access to now, so let's have a little look down in the basement. So we now have access to black gloves. I'm not sure if these are better than a combat bracelet, but they are definitely cheaper. So here we go. I'm going to use this Cook Jubbly on Scratch. Ooh, Ugglegui. And there we go. That's another one. So pretty sure that's Mithril gloves that I've got access to now. It's always good. Um, now I figured I only need to do, um, I need to get a Wily Cat. Uh, well, I don't need to get a Wily Cat. I'm probably going to get a Wily Cat so I can do the Evil Dave section. So the catching the mice part in the dungeon is going to be a massive pain in the bum. Um, so I'm going to get a Wily Cat, a Wily Hellcat. I then need to start the Legends quest. Not complete it, but I'm going to complete it anyway. And then I need to get 70 cooking as well. So they're the three major requirements I need to complete um, the Recipe for Disaster quest. Um, but, you know, it's not too far away. Nothing really that's going to be a pain in the butt. Um, the Legends quest will be probably the biggest pain. Um, but then, then again... Completing that Legends quest really won't be too difficult anyway. So the Barrows gloves are looking very, very promising for me right now. And I'm just, I just want to get these Barrows gloves over and done with because they are the best gloves you can get in the game. And there's 57 magic. I'm going to continue in hopefully getting 59 so I can complete the Family Crest quest. Here we are approaching 50... Did I have enough Camelot teleports? There we go. One teleport off. There's 59 magic that allows me to cast, I think it's the Fire Blast, and I can then complete Family Crest, get me those cooking gloves, um, and those quest points, and the requirements to complete Legends Quest. I'm going to go complete the Family Crest now, hopefully, and then uh, get 70 cooking so I can then get my, I think it's the, the Mithril Gloves. I think it is the Mithril Gloves, anyway, from the rest of V4 Disaster. So, if I can find old mate Diminithus, here we go. 
Family Crest Quest Com Puddly Plead. There we go. Got the uh, Steel Gauntlets. Going to transfer those into Cooking Gauntlets. And, um, you know, that quest was, was pretty easy. So, um, going to head over to Old Mate and start, get, I guess, get 70 cooking so I can complete Recipe for Disaster.